Good morning. How are you? I am fine. What about you? I am fine. Yes. Can I have your resume? Yes, ma'am. Yes, Sanjay. Please introduce yourself. Okay, ma'am. Thank you for this opportunity for introducing myself. My name is Sanjay. My native place is Radhana Sushila District. But currently staying in Hyderabad. Coming to my B.Tech graduation, Anamasari Institute of Technology and Science in the stream of civil engineering. Um, coming to my B.Tech uh, project is seismic analysis using with and without shear walls uh, by using ETAPS. My strengths are uh, my parents and I am my planner. My weakness is how to trust in new people. On that time, I will get low motivated and alone. On that time, that is my weakness. And coming to think my hobby, sir, playing indoor games like Shetil and outdoor games is Karam. And coming to my family background, including me, there is my father and my mother. That much about me. Thank you. Okay. You mentioned your hobbies as. Indoor game. Mm, indoor games. Can I say it in detail? What type of game? Uh, indoor games means like schedule. I have played schedule means mm. according to the college level. I went to up to the runner. In college. Mm, in college levels. So you mentioned your weakness is trusting people. Uh, trusting people. Now how are you overcoming it? According to the situation. According to the situation. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you have done course at in Manual. Manual and automations and Java also. Okay. And also you have mentioned your skills as MS Office, mm -hmm. Windows. Windows. Excellent PowerPoint. Excellent words and PowerPoint. Nice. You are good in that? Ah, yes. Okay. So what is software testing? Software testing is nothing but the, according to the client requirements, we will do the, the client requirements are not uh, satisfied or not, that is software testing. What is manual testing? Manual testing is uh, developed by, an application is developed by the human, human, human interactions, mm -hmm. it is called manual testing. Okay. Can you say the difference between the project and product? Okay. Mm -hmm. Project is uh, project is uh, an application developed by client requirements. Mm -hmm. uh, there are some project based companies like TCS and Tech Mahindra, mm -hmm. etc. There are some basic companies. Mm -hmm. And coming to product, uh, that means uh, product means uh, an application developed by uh, and client requirements and entire market client requirements is called product. And according to the product based companies, there are so many uh, companies out there like Google, Gmail, Yahoo, etc. Okay. What is spiral model? Spiral model is nothing but the uh, planning, analysis, uh, design, mm. uh, in, uh, engineering, and maintenance. Okay, how it works? Like repetitions of cycles, according to the repetitions of cycles. Mm -hmm. There is a longer project okay. that is called uh, according to the client requirement. Mm -hmm. They will use the language and dynamic requirements. Mm -hmm. That is called um, spiral model. So, what are the ceremonies in, in Agile? There are five ceremonies in Agile process. Mm -hmm. One is sprint plan meeting. Next come um, metro spectro meeting, spectro active meeting, uh, grooming, the, uh, stand up meeting. These are ceremonies in agile process. What is the difference between sprint backlog and product backlog? Product backlog means all user stories mm. prepared by product owner in the starting of agile process. Yes. And sprint backlog? Uh, sprint backlog means all user committed committed by all user stories. They have and called QA. Okay. 
list of committed and stories by QA and Dev for a particular sprint that is called the sprint backlog. Okay. So now, what is test matrix? Uh, test matrix there are. Uh, why we should we will use this matrix means according to the manager we have some uh, to we have to show some percentages how we have complete the work there is some formulas uh, execute test cases executed or not executed how many test cases is possible and how many test cases is failed there is some formulas for um, test cases executed number of test cases executed by test case written into 100 that is one formula and another one is uh, number of uh, not uh, execute, test cases executed and how many we have written test cases into 100 that is formula so we will use test matrix what is bug life cycle? Uh, bug life cycle is also known as defect life cycle mm. Mm. why we will use it is means changing the entire lifespan mm. uh, um, there is one defect, uh, defect found by testers. Uh, according to the issues, different types, there is uh, some issue types like new, new and open. New or open, um, that is one type, issue type. After that, we will assign to the developers. That um, developers, what will they will do means they will uh, they will run the code. The code is correct or not. After that, they will send to the retesters. Uh, the what we what the retesters will do means uh, the code is correct or not, or uh, it is if it is okay, if it is working properly, the, the retesters will close. Uh, after uh, if it is not working properly, they will re, uh, retesters they will reopen and they will again send to assign. That is the process. I know in that. Duplicate, invalid, uh, fix. They will fix some issues. No, cannot fix problems. Deferred and RFM, RFE. RFE means requirement frequency enhancement. That is the I put the budget. Can you write a test case, a test scenario, a test yes, case ma'am. for login page? Yes, ma'am. I can write a put the test case, test scenario, I put the email. Gmail or anything, if you like, I can write. Yes. Okay, can you explain? Yes, ma'am. What you have done to improve your knowledge in the last one year? Because you have studied, your uh, education completed in 2022, right? Yes, yes, this last one year, what are the steps you have to, to improve your knowledge? Yes, ma'am. Yes. I have improved more knowledge through. I have completed PTA graduation in 2022. Mm -hmm. Up to now, I have tweeted so many things in YouTube. I have prepared so many things like uh, uh, I have learned some basic knowledge like C, C, plus, plus, Python. And coming to technical skills is aptitude and communication skills. Mm -hmm. That is my improved uh, from last since one year. That is over complaints. Okay. Who do you like for the company? No ma'am, according to the situation, uh, first I will do the result to the um, problem. Mm -hmm. After that, in case, uh, there is a, another situation like um, we can say our pro um, project manager and clients in that uh, way the client require uh, for us client requirement will come on. In that time, uh, I will say some like that's not the okay. To be safe side in that, my project manager and my colleagues. You won't like, or, like to your manager and uh, team? Uh, but uh, to protect them, to protect them, I will like. To protect them, you will like. Uh, yes. okay. What is the difference between smart work and hard work? Uh, smart work means uh, in, in, in um, certain time mm -hmm. we have to complete the work means that is smart time. Mm -hmm. According to the long process, mm -hmm. uh, 
long process means uh, project has given some time. Mm -hmm. We will go to long process, and that is means hard work too. So for small project and all, you will do smart work? Ah, mm, in a certain time I will complete some speed work. In a short period of time you ah, will uh, complete, uh, complete, you complete the work. Ah. That is. So hard work? Hard work is so much long process that is hard work. Okay. What the success mean to you in your life? Success mean to you means uh, according to me, mm. I have I have faced some issue. Mm. The why means coming to my B.Tech graduation, my friends told me that you cannot able to complete the B.Tech graduation, mm. um, and I, I have showed to them mm. in a certain period of time mm. I have completed the B.Tech graduation and I have proved what I am. That is my success mean to me. So people or uh, when you are they are discouraging you, mm -hmm. they are saying you are not capable, that time you are proving that. Ah, yes, so that is a success to me. Good. What is time management? According to the time management, there are four types. Mm -hmm. Do and delete and uh, how you will manage your time? Uh, according to the situation, project situation, okay. we will uh, complete the time in time. In time. Uh, that is time and So what are the steps you will take to complete that? Uh, coming to my project company, mm -hmm. there is some project team. Mm -hmm. I will say that uh, project by means time uh, time will be reduced. That is time and they will complete uh, at a time together we will complete the work means okay. we will come uh, that is uh, in time you are supporting the team work uh, you will get the help from the, the team uh, that is in time okay good so that's all Sanjay do you have any questions with me yes ma'am uh, can you include a feedback about me feedback. what I should uh, do improve myself Yes, Sanjay, you have to improve a lot. Um, your uh, answer for this question is good. But you have to be so confident what you are saying. You are saying is, uh, what you are saying is good. You have to be more confident on that. And your body language and eye contact is and all everything good. So, we will see in further on. Okay? Thank you.